Well, there's always a sense of excitement and anticipation for a day at the races, but today has undeniably felt extra special. People are taking precautions. This isn't back to normal by any means, but there was some real joy at being able to socialise again after months of various stages of lockdown. People very pleased to be back, and if you don't believe me, you can hear it straight from the horse's mouth. Superb, man. It's probably one of the better days we've had in a long time. Yeah, we, we expect that in here. I mean, today, yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah, 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 it's yeah. really good, good weather, good, nice day. It feels wonderful. It feels great. It feels nice to be out in the open with others and socialise once again. Yeah, and get to see the horses again. It's been a really long time, so we're really happy. It's a lot better. Not nice to be back to normal. It's nice to have some yeah. normality back yes. to look forward to. We're, yeah. we're getting there, aren't we? So. Yeah. It's a bit surreal, really. We're not sure whether we're doing the right thing or not, but it's, it's lovely. Getting racing back on here in a COVID safe way has been a big challenge for Carlisle Racecourse, but General Manager Molly Dingwall says it means so much to see the punters back and explained how she hopes things will move going forward. Oh, it's so difficult to put into words. I just walked out of the office and saw all those people. And honestly, I felt a little bit emotional, actually, you know, to see the race course back being used how it should be, seeing people enjoying themselves, seeing people that they haven't seen in, in such a long time. You know, I always say it's like a family, the racing community. And it, honestly, it was so wonderful to see. And the protocols you've got in place seem to be working very well. Yes, obviously there are a lot of protocols that we need to follow. Um, all tickets had to be booked in advance with their track and trace. Um, we've got hand sanitizer at every doorway, um, two metre social distancing, um, we've got screens up, um, all drinks have to be ordered on an app and then they're brought to the table and you have to be seated. So yes, there's lots of things that we need to sort of work with and, and work, you know, get everybody to do correctly. But as long as that happens, you know, it's just it's amazing. And of course, it isn't just the race course itself. Spare a thought for some of the small operators who rely on the racing industry in order to make a living. The cleaners, the bar staff, the bookmakers. We spoke to one local bookie who says he's thrilled to be back at work after the hardest year he can remember. It's been a terrible 14 months. We've only worked three days on course in the 14 months at three trials. So we're happy to be back. Admittedly, it's not back as normal. We need the June the 21st, the roadmap to continue and hopefully then social distancing, etc. Restrictions will be lifted, but it is great to be back, admittedly, yeah. This has been by no means business as usual here. We've seen a lot of COVID precautions. Some people still wearing face masks outside as well as in. But it has felt like a step towards normality, a sense that things are getting better. And should it be safe and sensible to do so, we may get more freedoms before the summer's out.